Welcome friends. I'm here to help you through a guided meditation. This one's called Hot Air Balloon. The bones of this come from Max Heistein, although I've added a lot of my own uh, throughout. So find yourself in a comfortable seat, wherever that is for you. You can sit up on a prop so your hips are higher than your knees. You can inhale a nice tall spine, crown of the head, reaching toward the heavens. And you could gently exhale. You could find yourself in a kneeling position, sitting with your legs extended out in front of you, or even in a chair. And if you're not feeling well, you could also do this while you're lying on the couch or lying on your bed. So let's take one deep inhale, expand our belly like a balloon, and gently exhale. And you could close your eyes or you could just stare at the candle flames or the lights on the altar here. And imagine yourself in a nice big open field and in the distance you see a beautiful hot air balloon that's waiting for you. So you're going to slowly start to walk toward that hot air balloon. And as you take mindful steps, you notice that there are pebbles beneath your feet. And there are red, different shades of red, mahogany, And as your feet gently walk on top of the red pebbles, you can say to yourself, I am grounded and I have everything I need. You get a little bit closer to the hot air balloon and you notice that the pebbles start to turn an orange color, the color of pumpkins. And as you're walking over these orange pebbles, you can say, I am creative in all aspects of my life. And as you get a little bit closer, you look down and you notice that there are yellow pebbles under your feet now. And you say to yourself, I am strong and balanced. And you get about halfway to that hot air balloon and the pebbles under your feet change to a beautiful emerald green color. It matches the color of the forest. And you could say to yourself, I am loved. And you saunter a little bit closer to the hot air balloon and notice that the pebbles under your feet are a really light pale blue color. And you could say to yourself, I hear and I speak the truth. And you're getting a little bit closer, you're almost to that hot air balloon. And the pebbles under your feet change to a deep, dark, navy blue. And you could say to yourself, I trust that my life is unfolding exactly as it should be. And you're almost at the hot air balloon. You're starting to get excited. And the pebbles under your feet change to a beautiful purple color. And you could say to yourself, I am at peace. I am whole. And you feel the nice crisp air gently blowing on your face. And as you come up to that hot air balloon, you notice that there's a brass plaque with your name engraved on it. So it's waiting for you.
And as you try to get into the hot air balloon, you notice that you're carrying a backpack, a little hiker's day pack, but it's really heavy. So as you try to climb into that hot air balloon basket, the backpack's kind of weighing you down a little bit. So you can take that backpack off, and you could hop into that hot air balloon basket. And you decide to look into the backpack and see why it's so heavy. So you unzip it slowly, and you peek in, and that's where all of your worries and stresses and anxieties are. So let's start to get rid of them. So you can reach in to the backpack and you're going to pull out a glop of gray goop. And you're going to think of something that's worrying you that kind of looks like it could be gray and goopy. And as you're holding this or trying to hold this in your hand, maybe you're trying to massage it to both hands to keep it from dripping onto your shoes, you can think of that worry or anxiety. And you could grab it now in your dominant hand and you could think about what's worrying you. And I want you to take your arm back and try to throw it as far as you can. Since it is kind of slimy, it's not going to go very far. But you can watch it go out of the basket, out of your mind. And it's going to hit the grass and it's just going to kind of dissolve into the grass. And you can take a moment here, take a deep breath into your belly, expand it like a balloon. And exhale, let whatever was bothering you just melt away into that grassy field. As you take a deep breath, you're definitely lighter. The hot air balloon basket maybe rises a little bit off the ground, even though you're still, you're still tied in, but it feels a little bit lighter. So let's reach inside. There's a few more things in that backpack of yours. Let's reach inside and be gentle this time. This time it's a really heavy, heavy metal spiky ball. So you can pull that out. It's the size of a softball. It's pretty large. So as you examine that ball, you can look at it. And you can think about something it's bothering you, worrying you, stressing you out. And you could send it into that heavy metal spiky ball. And take a deep breath in. Pull back your dominant hand. And this time just let it go. And just throw that ball across that field. It's going to bounce a bunch of times making rivets into the grass. And it's going to go all the way into the woods. You won't even be able to see it anymore. So watch it go. Take a nice deep inhale into your belly. And let it go. You stand up nice and tall in your hot air balloon basket. You feel a little bit lighter. The basket comes off the ground. You're almost ready to go. But you, you jostle that little hiking backpack and there's still some, one more other thing in there. So reach in. I think you might need two hands for this one. Reach in and it's like a huge, musty, looks like an encyclopedia book. So you take it out, you can crack it open a little bit. And maybe you see something, if you're a journaler, maybe you see a journal page entry that you've done about something that's been bothering you. Or maybe you see a photograph 
or a memory. And you can think about that for a moment. Take a nice deep inhale, thinking about that. And as you exhale, you can gently close that book. Take a nice deep inhale and lift that book up over your head. And as you exhale, just throw it out as far as you can. And it's gonna come down with a huge crashing thud. It might even scare a couple of wildlife animals out there. Maybe the birds, the chipmunks. And you take a nice deep breath. And as you exhale, you can't see where that went anymore. It disappeared. Your worry's gone. So now, I think you're ready to go for your ride. So you can take a nice deep inhale, just looking around at the scenery, at the woods, the clouds, the sky. And take a nice deep exhale. And in the bottom of that hiking backpack, there's nothing left except for a little tiny uh, little leather knife. So you can take it out of that leather sheath. And slowly you're going to go around to the four corners of the hot air balloon basket. And you'll take a nice deep breath. And as you exhale, you'll cut one corner of the hot air balloon basket. And you feel a little bit lighter. You go to the second corner. You, the knife is so sharp, you just you cut the rope and it pops right up. You go to the third corner. You're almost ready to go. You slice that rope just like a hot knife through butter. And you brace yourself as you get to the fourth corner. You cut that rope. And now you can finally fly up. You are free. This balloon is filled with healing. All of your worries are behind you. They're below you. And as you become higher and higher, Take a nice deep breath into your belly and exhale. Your worries become thinner. You're feeling lighter and you are free. You can take a moment here to just look around, enjoy the view. You could visualize all of your affairs being exactly how you want them. Visualize your life going the way you want, going the way you hope, going the way you might be planning. With each inhale, you're lighter, more positive, more happy. a couple more deep breaths here. You're feeling calmer peaceful, lighter. My balloon's starting to come down a little bit. And you see your favorite place in the whole wide world down a little bit further. So you're going to start to come down and you're almost ready to land your balloon. So visualize that happy place, your favorite place. It might be completely empty. 
You might have your favorite chair in there. You might have a favorite person or a four-legged animal, two-legged animal. You might have your favorite mug, your favorite pillow. And you see a little landing spot right in the backyard area there. And you start to come down and land that balloon. And as soon as the basket bumps onto the ground, just take a nice deep breath here. And let it go. And you could get out of your basket. Head on over to that special place of yours. And just get seated and get comfortable. And you could say to yourself, I am safe. I am creative in all aspects of my life. I am strong and balanced. I am loved. I hear and I speak the truth. I trust that my life is unfolding exactly as it should be. I am at peace and I am whole. And you can take a nice deep breath in and let it go. And I invite you to stay in your happy place as long as you like. And when you're ready, you can gently allow your chin to come down toward your chest. And just gently look from shoulder to shoulder. And flitter open your eyes a little bit. And take a deep breath in and let it go. And I thank you for sharing your meditation practice with me today. Namaste.